So this is going to be a quick update about QGIS. Uh, luckily, Dartmoor Mike informed me, or th like thankfully, Dartmoor Mike informed me that there had been an update on QGIS. Um, in between me recording and putting the video out, so the way I do things in the video has changed, or explain things in the video for setting it up. So I've completely uninstalled it from my PC. I'm going to reinstall it so that I can see what everybody else is seeing so that I can run through with you how to get the information you need. And it's all to do with the Google map thing and the quick map um, situation. So we come to the website, we go here, we go there, we download. And let it do its thing um, once it's downloaded I'll do the install um, and then bring you into it I mean, I just wanted to be as transparent as possible so you don't think I'm trying to pull wool over eyes and finger me jobs um, so yeah we'll just let this get in and then we'll come straight in and then we'll have it okay so that is downloaded Double click on it. Everything's on a go slow today. Preparing to install. So this takes a hot minute or two. And we'll click on next. I accept. Next. Create desktop. Yes, please. Create start menu. Shortcut. No. We don't want to start menu shortcut. Um so there we go we'll install and then we'll let it do its thing here and then and then we'll do the next bit oh yes I do there we go so computing space requirements all right so we'll just leave it to do this because it just takes a minute or two all right so now it's finished installing we're gonna click finish and that should all be in our file just like it was before and it will be 3.40.2 as opposed to 0.1 um, we come in here uh, all the same we go to the desktop version and open it up okay so once we have QGIS installed and all loaded up and ready to go um, you'll notice that mine is still different from yours and up here we still have quick map services and because I've got previous um, versions installed and I've tried to delete everything it's still remembering my settings so the way I show you to do it is you come up to quick map it's got it come up to web it's got quick map installed already and then you come down to settings um, you go to more services go to get contributed pack install and then save all right um, what you're going to need to do now is come over to plugins because yours doesn't have quick map installed now so you need to come over to plugins click on plugins go to manage and install plugins and then in here if you just search it so you just write quick map like that it will find it immediately as you can see it's installed I'll turn it off and show you so you sh I believe what you're getting is you're getting this so you come to web and then there's nothing here all right so what you need to do and I'll show you is you come to plugins I've already showed you backwards <laughs> you come to plugins <clears throat> make sure you're on all go to the search type in quick map there's your plugin you want you'll need to install it right and then make sure it's checked and then you should have it all here then you'll need to do your settings more services get contributed pack 
first version of Contrib Pack was downloaded. OK and save. All right. And then it should all be there. And then you want Google and then Google Satellite. That's what you'll need. OK. I hope that helps. If you still got problems, please, please message me and I will do my utmost to be able to sort out whatever it is. But that should cure the problem for QGIS.